Hi everyone, I am here for day 22 of my 3030 challenge. And I am here at one of my favorite restaurants, Yao. Um, I'm not here because I had planned to be here because I actually had planned to be in an event on the beach, but it didn't really work out. And actually um, it is starting to rain and it's overcast. So I was all dressed up with nowhere to go. So I called my husband, Andres, and I said, let's go to dinner. And he came, I'm trying to convince him to go to a movie, but let's see. So today I had a different question, but I will change the question uh, because the environment has changed. And I want to answer a question about something that is actually um, resonating in the world today uh, with the situation that happened at the Oscars earlier this week and it's the only thing most people are talking about and I do want to give my opinion of how I feel about the three participants in this scandal in the scene or what have you I like to start with Jada um, you know many people are saying that you know she's bad she's manipulative she caused him to do this he was defending her but from my point of view, she was genuinely hurt hearing the comment. She was not expecting it. It caught her off guard. It hurt her. She expressed a natural emotion of being hurt by having someone to say what they said. Now, as far as the reaction of Will Smith, he defended his wife. I mean, I have been thinking about this all week because actually a similar scenario happened with me and my husband, Andres, who I have known since 2009. And um, he defended me one time. And it was not a pretty situation, but there was a scenario with my ex and him, and he reacted and he defended me. It was a natural reaction because it is natural for one to want to defend and protect a loved one. What would you do if someone just really hurt somebody you love? I'm not saying to condone violence. I am totally not saying that, but it was an impromptu natural reaction, right or wrong. It was impromptu and it was natural. And maybe he should not have done it but I don't think that we should destroy his life and his future because of kind of losing his head for the moment. Now, as far as Chris Rock, wow. All I have to say is wow. Stand up, professional, quick on his feet. I mean, wow, that, that is all I have to say. How he responded, how he reacted how he kept control, how he stayed professional. I mean, stand up. Stand up character, professional. I mean, my hat's off and much respect. And as far as the others, really, I really don't think that we should condemn them to hell because they're humans just like all of us. And we have all had weak moments where we have done something that maybe thinking back, maybe we should not have done. And then, you know, this started with just a natural reaction, a natural human reaction. And um, I think that uh, Jada is fortunate to have someone who would defend her. Um, I feel fortunate to have someone who actually defended me. Um, maybe I wouldn't go back and say, you should have knocked his block off. <laughs> like Andres actually did. That's a story for another day. But, um, you know, what can I say? We're all humans. We're all on this earth doing the best that we can. We are not perfect. I just feel like um, uh, an emotional reaction, a weak moment, maybe should not scar us for the rest of our lives. Like um, there is talk out there. I don't know what the solution needs to be, but that's just my opinion. Um, and I don't think that there was anybody at fault, but for sure, I would just say that Chris Rock definitely is the hero in this scenario. And um, 
That's just my two cents on the story.